What does ABONCLE stand for? I. American Board of Ophthalmology and National Contact Lens Examiners. B. American Board of Opticianry and National Contact Lens Examiners. Which of the following is not a role of an optician? A. Fitting eyeglasses. B. Administering eye exams. C. Dispensing contact lenses. D. Assisting customers in selecting frames. What is the purpose of the ABONCLE basic opticianry examination? A. To test knowledge and skills in basic optometry procedures. B. To assess proficiency in fitting contact lenses. C. To evaluate competence in optical dispensing and contact lens fitting. Which organization administers the ABONCLE basic opticianry examination? A. American Optometric Association, AOA. B. National Board of Examiners in Optometry, NBO. C. American Board of Opticianry, ABO. D. National Commission on Certification of Opticianry, NCCO. What topics are covered in the ABONCLE Basic Opticianry Examination? A. Only contact lens fitting and dispensing. B. Only optical dispensing. C. Optical dispensing and contact lens fitting, as well as basic anatomy and physiology of the eye. What is the minimum passing score for the ABONCLE basic opticianry examination? A. 50%. B. 60%. C. 70%. D. 80%. How often must opticians renew their certification with the ABONCLE? A. Every year. B. Every two years. C. Every three years. D. Every five years. Which of the following is true regarding the ABONCLE certification? A. It is mandatory for all opticians practicing in the United States. B. It is optional and demonstrates a commitment to professionalism and competence. What is the purpose of continuing education requirements for ABONCLE certification renewal? A. To ensure opticians stay up to date with advancements in the field. B. To increase the cost of certification renewal. C to discourage opticians from seeking certification. Which of the following is not a common duty of an optician? A. Fitting eyeglasses. B. Performing eye surgeries. C. Repairing frames. D. Advising patients on lens options. What is the function of a lensometer? A. To measure the curvature of the cornea. B. To measure the power and axis of lenses. C. To examine the retina. D. To test visual acuity. Which type of lens corrects astigmatism? A. Bifocal lens. B. Spherical lens. C. Toric lens. D. Multifocal lens.
What does the term pupil distance refer to? A. The distance between the two eyes. B. The distance from the pupil to the lens. C. The distance from the pupil to the retina. D. The distance from the center of one pupil to the center of the other. Which lens material is known for its high impact resistance and lightweight properties? A. Glass. B. Polycarbonate. C. CR39. D. High index plastic. What is the function of an eyeglass frame's bridge? A. To support the weight of the lenses. B. To connect the two temples. C. To provide stability and comfort on the nose. D. To adjust the fit of the frame behind the ears. What does polarized mean in the context of sunglasses? A. They have a special coating to resist scratches. B. They have lenses that adjust to different lighting conditions. C. They reduce glare by filtering out horizontal light waves. D. They offer prescription options for astigmatism. Which type of lens coating reduces reflections and glare, providing clearer vision and reducing eye strain? A. Anti-scratch coating. B. UV coating. C. Anti-reflective coating. D. Tinted coating. What is the function of a lens edger in opticianry? A. To measure the curvature of lenses. B. To shape and finish lenses to fit into frames. C. To determine the pupillary distance. D. To check for aberrations in lenses. What is the primary advantage of progressive lenses over bifocal or trifocal lenses? A. Progressive lenses offer a wider field of vision for intermediate distances. B. Progressive lenses are more cost-effective. C. Progressive lenses are thinner and lighter. What is the function of the optician's pupillometer? A. To measure the width of the frame. B. To determine the pupillary distance. C. To assess the curvature of the cornea. D. To evaluate the fit of contact lenses. Which type of lens is used to correct presbyopia and allow clear vision at different distances? A. Spherical lens. B. Bifocal lens. C. Toric lens. D. Plano lens. Which lens feature allows lenses to darken when exposed to sunlight and return to clear indoors? A. Polarization. B. Anti-reflective coating. C. Photochromic technology. D. UV protection. What is the process called when an optician adjusts frames to ensure proper fit and comfort for the wearer? A. Glazing. B. Refraction. C. Dispensing. D. Fitting. Which lens type is recommended for individuals with high prescriptions to reduce lens thickness and weight? A. CR39. B. Polycarbonate. C. High index plastic. D. Glass.
What does the term astigmatism refer to in the context of vision correction? A. A condition where distant objects appear blurry. B. A condition where the cornea is irregularly shaped, causing distorted vision. C. A condition where the eye's natural lens becomes cloudy. What is the term for the process of grinding a lens to the correct shape to correct refractive errors? A. Glazing B. Surfacing C. Finishing D. Edging Which of the following is a common method for lens tinting? A. Thermal curing B. Ultrasonic treatment. C. Dye immersion. D. Electrophoretic coating. What does PD stand for in opticianry? A. Pupil distance. B. Prescription determination. C. Progressive design. D. Peripheral distortion. Which lens material is known for its lightweight and impact resistant properties, making it suitable for sports eyewear? A. CR39. B. Polycarbonate. C. High index plastic. What is the function of a lensometer in opticianry? A. To measure the power and axis of lenses. B. To determine the pupillary distance. C. To assess the curvature of the cornea. D. To measure the width of the frame. Which lens feature helps reduce eye strain and fatigue by blocking harmful UV rays? A. Polarization B. Photochromic technology C. Anti-reflective coating D. UV protection Which lens type corrects myopia, nearsightedness? A. Convex lens. B. Concave lens. C. Bifocal lens. D. Progressive lens. What does AR coating stand for in opticianry? A. Advanced refraction coating. B. Anti reflection coating. C. Abrasion resistant coating. D. Automatic adjustment coating. Which lens material is known for its affordability and optical clarity? A. CR39. B. Polycarbonate. C. High index plastic. D. Glass. What is the purpose of a lens meter in opticianry? A. To measure the width of the frame. B. To measure the curvature of the cornea. C. To determine the pupillary distance. D. To verify the power and alignment of lenses. Which lens feature helps reduce glare from headlights and digital screens? A. Polarization B. Photochromic technology C. Anti-reflective coating D. UV protection Which lens type corrects vision at only one distance and is commonly used for either distance or reading purposes? A. Bifocal B. Trifocal C. 
progressive. D. Single vision. What is the function of a lens tint? A. To protect the eyes from harmful UV rays. B. To enhance contrast and reduce glare. C. To provide impact resistance. D. To adjust the focal length of the lens. Which lens type corrects both myopia and hyperopia in the same lens? A. Bifocal. B. Trifocal. C. Progressive. D. Single vision. What does the term index of refraction refer to in the context of optics? A. The amount of light transmitted through a lens. B. The speed of light in a given medium. C. The degree to which light is bent as it passes through a lens. What is the function of lens blocking in the lens manufacturing process? A. To apply specialized coatings to the lens surface. B. To shape and edge the lens to fit into a frame. C. To bond the lens to the lens meter for power verification. D. To determine the lens prescription. What is the purpose of a lens prescription? A. To determine the appropriate frame size for the patient. B. To indicate the lens material and coating options. C. To specify the corrective power needed for each eye. D. To outline the steps for lens fabrication. Which lens feature helps reduce eye strain and fatigue by filtering out harmful blue light from digital screens? A. UV protection. B. Polarization. C. Blue light filtering. D. Anti-reflective coating. What is the role of a lens blank in the lens manufacturing process? A. To determine the lens prescription. B. To provide the base material for the lens. C. To shape and edge the lens to fit into a frame. D. To apply specialized coatings to the lens surface. Which lens type corrects vision at multiple distances with distinct segments for near, intermediate, and distance vision? A. Bifocal. B. Trifocal. C. Progressive. D. Single vision. What is the primary function of a lensometer in opticianry? A. To measure the width of the frame. B. To determine the pupillary distance. C. To verify the power and axis of lenses. D. To assess the curvature of the cornea. What is the primary advantage of using a lens edger in opticianry? A. It allows for precise lens measurement and alignment. B. It automates the lens manufacturing process for increased efficiency. C. It shapes and finishes lenses to fit into frames accurately. What is the purpose of lens decentering in eyeglass fabrication? A. To adjust the focal length of the lens. B. To ensure proper alignment of the lens within the frame. C. To enhance the cosmetic appearance of the eyeglasses. D. To reduce reflections and glare from the lens surface.
What is the primary function of lens tinting in sunglasses? A. To reduce reflections and glare. B. To enhance contrast and reduce eye strain. C. To protect the eyes from harmful UV rays. D. To adjust the focal length of the lens. What is the function of lens blocking in the lens manufacturing process? A. To apply specialized coatings to the lens surface. B. To shape and edge the lens to fit into a frame. C. To bond the lens to the lens meter for power verification. D. To determine the lens prescription.